We are now just two days away from the start of March Madness. The SEMO Redhawks are the only team in our region to earn a big ticket to the big dance. The Redhawks and their fans held a selection show watch party at the Show Me Center tonight. News 3's Jake Siegel was with the team earlier and joins us in studio with more on who the Redhawks will face. Thanks, Gabby. When it comes to the big dance, we know anything can happen in March. That's why they call it March Madness. For the first time in 23 years, the SEMO Redhawks will break out those dancing shoes and will play in the first four on Tuesday night in Dayton, Ohio. Redhawks head coach Brad Korn showing off that OVC championship trophy. It's fresh and it's new. The Redhawks and their fans learning who, when and where they will play in the big dance. 16 seed SEMO has learned it'll face fellow 16 seed Texas A&M Corpus Christi on Tuesday at 440. The Redhawks and Islanders will be the first of two teams of the entire tournament to take the field. And now it finally feels real for both the players and the coaching staff. It's a massive deal for our region and the team says they just want to focus and not make this moment bigger than it really is. It's just basketball, you know, to, to not get distracted by a lot of what's going on. There's going to be distractions. There's going to be nervous feelings, of course. That's human nature. But now to just settle in and focus on basketball. It's great for the community to be able to come out and support us like this. Uh, something we work for all year, and we're honestly just ready to get back to work uh, and get back playing. You know, everybody's excited. It's it's great, but now it's on to the next step, and that's playing a basketball game. It's crazy, actually, because I come from a school that ain't been to the big dance in like 23 years, so for us to be in a conversation with Alabama, it's a blessing. And you heard Red Hawks sophomore guard Philip Russell mentioned just a moment ago that this team is now in the same breath as number one seed Alabama. That's massive. Of course, SEMO, as we know, doesn't want to overlook Texas A&M Corpus Christi. But if the red and black can somehow win on Tuesday, they'll face Alabama on Thursday night. In the studio, Jake Siegel, News 3 Sports.